All right, we are back with number 26 now on the list. So this is one that I still have. I'm probably going to be just using it up pretty soon. Um, I don't think it's one that I'm going to be buying again. So this is number 26. This is going to be eucalyptus Greek yogurt. So I have to say, like to be completely honest, this is one of the best soaps for your skin. After using it the first time, you could just already feel a big difference. Um, it is, now I know this isn't like the newer packaging for this, but I think it's still a zero grit bar. I don't think they added oatmeal to it, but if they did, you can correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but I believe this is a zero grit bar. So, um, it's actually not a really bad scent at all. It's just not super strong. So you get that soapy type scent a little bit, and then... You can smell a little bit of the sour Greek yogurt, which is the part that I don't love about the bar, but it is good for your skin, so I, I understand that. And then the eucalyptus is not strong at all. It's a, a very weak scent. And that's another thing I like about, oh, I'll bring this one back. So this icy eucalyptus has a very strong eucalyptus scent to it, which I love. I love the eucalyptus scent, but unfortunately, for this bar, it's just not very strong. The yogurt almost overpowers it. So, this is a very good bar to have. I actually recommend that everybody try the Eucalyptus Greek yogurt at least once. It's just a nice bar to try out. And the scent is not, it's not a bad scent. It's really not a bad scent. But it's nothing overly special either. So that's why it's number 26 on my list. And again, as far as the, the ingredients go, it's a very simple bar. It's just your normal soap stuff. And then you're going to have some sea salt, the eucalyptus, and then Greek yogurt. So uh, yeah, it is a great bar to check out. And if you have like sensitive skin, it might be one of your regulars. But for me, uh, I'm just going to keep it at number, yeah, number 26 on the list. So this is kind of where the list starts to go into the more mediocre soaps. They're not bad at all. Like, this is not a bad bar of soap. And I don't know if I will be ordering another one after this one's over, but I may. So it's not bad. In my opinion, this is kind of where, where my, my rankings go from not so great soap for me to these are some of the mid the mid soaps. So they're really not not too terrible. All right, so that's going to finish up this video. And then for the next one, we will be at, wow, 25, number 25 for the next one. So we'll see you next time.